Hello, my lovely Cancerian. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Cancer, today we'll do your daily read for December 15 and the 16 of 2019. As you know, loves, this is a general read. I resonate with you, might not. Also, if you are inclined to see this video by the title or you are drawn to see this video for this daily, it's here a message for you. And yes, loves, we are in mid-December, crossing by. Also, count your blessing, loves. This year is gonna end very, very fast. But let's hear what we have for this daily. And I choose a Wisdom of the Oracle card as an advice for this daily. Also, I use the Illuminati Tarot as overall energy and our Rider Tarot reading. Yes, loves, let's see here what we got for you as I got already your card. But first thing first, I want you to understand that this is for Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science. And sometimes check your Sun, Moon, Rising or Science or Venus or you know because sometimes in my readings I might speak directly to you sometimes I might speak directly to a cross watcher sometimes when I mention the science because many of you asking for those science could be in your chart those signs could be in the person's chart the person you are dealing with chart Okay, so be very mindful. Let's not be judging because this channel has been created for guidance, for enlightenment, for getting messages, and just for positivity. Okay, but let's see here, loves. From the wisdom of the oracle, we have round and round, number 25. As you see, it's all blue, and this is you. For many of you Cancerians, you are dealing with somebody and just like go in circles. Yeah, but let's read it. What is the true meaning and in the relationships? Number 25. Also, 2 plus 5 is number 7. It's a very spiritual number, 7, as you know that. But let's see here, 25, round and round. The essential meaning of the card is the spiritual quality of events when a lesson isn't quite integrated, cycles you are challenges to break, revisiting a pattern from a new perspective and regards your relationship are you wondering, how did I get here again? Does something feel familiar right now in your dynamics with others? Maybe a little too familiar? Don't be surprised that you have found yourself repeating an old story with the same sort of person who may not look similar but who attracted you because of your easy acquaintance with his or her qualities. Your relationship is a mix of what is good and what is potential challenging. You have been drawn to this person through the perfection of spirit's plan for your evolution. You may have circled back to an accustomed spot, a familiar place, but that's fine as you go, as you get to do things again, only differently this time. For you learn something of great value since the last time around. How will you choose to behave now that you are aware? Remain curious and stay out of the blame game. So loves round and round for me symbolize that you might go round and round with somebody and for some of you, you might go with a totally different person in the same pattern so be aware of that loves okay 
But let's see here overall energy for this daily and how we're moving forward. Let's see here. Spirit, give me some insight for Cancerian and whatever Cancer wants to know, whatever Cancer needs to hear for this daily. I love this deck very, very much, but it's so hard to maneuver, so hard to go and get along. But let's see here. As the Spirit asked me to do so this daily, I will do it so. We have Queen of Wands, my deal with the fire sign in here. But let's cut the deck. I have no idea why I got the, the this card from up. Because usually we're getting from the down. Ace of Cups. Seven of Cups. Look how beautiful they are. And Lovers. And Nine of Cups underneath the deck. Yes, you might deal with somebody here very sexy, very attractive, very much like they have so many qualities. This could be you, Cancer, okay? Because as the general reading, you flip the energies. I definitely see here you aiming for true love here. You want love, but you need to choose here. Is this the one or is this one off? Okay, because that's what I'm feeling here. Could be a Gemini with fire or a fire sign with Gemini in the chart, but is your choice. If this person keeps their options open and you are aiming for the true love here, Think about it because you need to choose what is best for you, not what best for others. Okay? But let's see here, Cancer, what this is about. If you're dealing with a fire sign or a Gemini, I feel here you should continue to see this reading. All right, loves, let's see. Very much debating, is this true love or is just here, here and there? For some of you, you are debating if I'm settling down with this person Am I will have something better later on or not? For some of you, you are debating on that. But let's see here. Eight of Cups. Underneath, let's see here. Ten of Swords, Empress. Okay, Hermit. King of Pentacles. Three of Wands. For some of you, you're ending a relationship with somebody here. That that person is very distant from distant from you. You might want somebody else in here. Wow. And Spirit says, if you really want to go forward, you need to speak it up. You need to verbalize what you want because I don't feel you talking with this person right now. And it's kind of you choose to not talk with them. Okay? I feel here you have somebody in your mind that you want to go towards. Okay? Cancer. Stick with the story. It is a Taurus Virgo Capricorn here. They're still hoping that, that you will work out things with them. Maybe for the kids. But I definitely see here something it is ending. Was a third party in between? Between you two? And you now know? That's why you might block this person or you might not want it to be with them. I feel here this person has a lot of regrets. They learn a lot. They could be a little bit older here. 
but I see you having a new beginning. Could be a Leo, Aries, Sag. Absolutely, absolutely. And I will tell you why here. It is a Sag, Aries, Leo. First, you might not know because you are very much debating is this person somebody good to you or not. I definitely see it is a couple in here. Okay? You are still very much debating between two people. And I feel here you'll make a decision with this Queen of Swords. For some of you, you're dealing with a fire or you want to go towards a fire or an air. You have a choice to do your loves. Also, I've been quite a bit of time here. What you should do? How should you proceed here? Okay. It's somebody it could be at your work environment. But I definitely see here you like this person. I'm not saying you love or you might fall in love with this person in a very short time. Believe me or not, Kinserian, you have a lot of people, they might tell you this is not a good thing for you because that could affect your money or your finances. I don't feel you really care because I see here you deep inside you know what works for you. You aiming for a new beginning in here. Let's see here. Why this Ten of Swords? For some of you, you've been betrayed in the past with an Earth sign, from an Earth sign. Okay? And right now, you don't really know what to do. You have new love, loves. Ace of Cups twice. Okay? Temperance, Sag energy again. Could be a fire with earth in the chart. It's kind of what it shows me here. If you deal with an earth person, earth sign, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn in the past, and that person had fire, now into your life comes a fire sign with earth in the chart. And it's like don't fall for those patterns okay for some of you you feel like this person is very very charismatic very good very good to your kids and i don't say the past person didn't were or they were not they did but it's just like very similar very familiar here a past person who you've been they are healing. Also, I see you try to heal from that past person. That person still loves you. Whatever has been between you two. Like besides being here, they still want to care and want. Let's see here. What decision you will make here? Because I see you making a decision. Chariot, this is you, love. I definitely see you... You hoping and you wanted something else. You manifesting something else. Again, Spirit says do not fall for those patterns because I feel here you'll be very confused. It is somebody younger than you, Cancer, who you might fall in love in a very short time. Although this person shows me as a soulmate here and is a good potential for you. In the next two years, if you meet this person right now, because I feel here, you you know this person. And in the next two years, you could be in a stable relationship here. Let's see. Yes, yeah, definitely Sag energy here. Okay. Sag with Earth. This Sagittarius, they may have children here. Okay. Let's see, why you are so unsure what to do? You might feel like the finances are not real, what you have right now, or you feel unstable. Definitely you need to make a choice 
and you don't really know how to make it what to do seven of cups twice and I clarified this two of pentacles you're very much imbalanced financially emotionally or at least that's how you feel that's why you don't really know what you truly need to have next into your life what truly I need to choose what's my next step because I feel here where you're going it's awesome ten of cups ace of pentacles you might allow into your life a twin energy here for some of you is the true love you're looking for I feel here also a lot of people are talking and telling you things move on for some of you wheel of fortune again is round and around is following the same pattern also for those of you who listen to others I will say listen to your heart and listen to your intuition okay because if it's coming a Sag here, it shows me here as an Earth energy. If it's an, an Earth, it's like a fire. So it's kind of a mirror what you had before. So be very much aware. For some of you, is an opportunity of a new job. You feel it's awesome. Do not rush into making a decision here. Because it seems to me a little small You've been very much debating, should I take the offer or should I not? Look in the contract, whatever is out there, because it's something shady out there. Okay? Be aware of that cancer. Let's see here. What you should do in this case. What my cancerians needs to do in this case. Queen of Pentacles work on yourself self-love self-care taking care of yourself being in your power also work on you work on your money finances work on your trust issues on your groundness because if you feel something is not what it looks like that is true yes absolutely follow your intuition if your gut tells you with the high priestess by seeing energy here if your gut is telling you that you had before the same thing do you need it again be very mindful here seems very promising absolutely but if you see any red flags it's like abort the mission. I feel here you will very much be in like, what I gotta do? This person is awesome. I might fall in love. Looks good. But it's a thing here because this person might have other suitors or that person is somebody who keeps secretly other options. If my concern is not there for me truly, then I will keep going. It's not like they stop right here for you and being there for you. You'll need to choose. And also, Spirit says, speak it up. No matter what, speak it up. If you really want this person, because I feel here you are so much like, the temptation is hard to beat, but it's like, I want it. But if I'll say it, will I have it? You're not really sure. But anyway, speak it up. If you truly know your worth, and if you truly allow into your life just good things, say it out loud. Okay? All right, Cancer. I definitely see here this love it will hit your head hardly so be aware heads up and yeah thank you for watching many blessings to all of you Cancerians and of course loves will see you next time bye for now